Hey everyone, it's me, a panda, back with another custom content showcase. So today I will be sharing my downloads of eye color contacts because I found some amazing downloads that I am just so excited to share with you guys. But um, I hope you guys did also enjoy the first one I did with the hairstyles and I hope you guys found it very helpful to the way I arranged how to download each specific style and it did take me a really long time to put everything together because you know in case you did find a style you like you didn't have to go on a wild goose chase on the sims resource to hunt down that specific style so in case I don't think I've actually given the instructions in my first showcase since I didn't plan on doing it until after I finished filming but if you see something you guys like just refer to the style number that I'll place it below the screen here and you can refer to the download link uh, from the website given all right so um, for our female model it's going to be the same uh, Aurora Beauty I just went ahead and changed her hairstyle that way much clearer with nothing covering her face and then for our male model it's going to be Tae Yang I went ahead and made his eyes a lot bigger so you can see the color contacts but I don't know if we'll be using Tae Yang in this part we'll we'll see how things go all right so starting off let's move on to the color eye contacts and I have a whole bunch and let me just tell you I have a whole bunch and um, there's actually a lot more to it than this it's somehow placed into the makeup section so I'm going to show you the one where you can select from uh, clicking on the eye part of part as the, the color for different eyes all right so first one is the cat eye and it comes in a variety of colors it it looks like cats and then some of them looks like lizards or snakes or you know even dragons so it's a really cool fun uh, contact to play with if you're trying to create you know a certain theme like maybe a cat theme or lizard theme or I don't know what I'm talking about but it's a really fun uh, contact to play with and then the next one up has this kind of a natural look to it but very very it makes it pop if that makes any sense it makes the eyes really pop but at the same time Aurora eyes is really big so you can see the color contacts really really clear and I do really love this contact it's just I don't know it, it just looks so alluring if you know what I mean and then the rest of the contacts somehow ends up in the face paint section so for these look under face paint don't look under the eye section our first one under the face paint is going to be this one and I know it looks very fake I mean it's obviously not realistic but it's a really fun color contacts to play with it has a sort of bright color so it's really really fun to play with <laughs> and I do really like it I'm probably going to use this for one of my future sims maybe down the line I don't know yet but uh yeah so our next one let me just tell you if you do not watch this anime, you have no idea what I'm talking about, but it is a really cool, unique, dark kind of a um, feel vibe to this color contacts. So this is actually from um, a manga that they made into an anime called Naruto, and it's called the uh, Shuringen, and there's like different names for it, but this one comes in a crap load of different styles, selections, and some of them are actually from the anime, and I, and I think some are actually made up from the creator just for fun, because I've never seen it in anime, or at least none of my friends recognize it, but when I saw it, I was like, <gasps> I must download this. I must find a way for my sims to use these contacts because I was just stunned that, you know, someone really created these contacts because they're really cool. And if you know the story of where these contacts or who they represent for each character, you'll know what I mean. But if you don't, it's just a fun contacts to play with. All right, so next one. This one is really kind of a a really natural look to it. Right now it doesn't look natural on Aurora because I made her pupil really big and her eyes are really big but if you make them normal size they do look very alluring and they do come in a variety of colors. Very stunning eyes I must say. I think this creator is actually one of my favorite uh, CC creators because this uh, I think it's Centilia. Sorry I don't know I'm like totally bashing her name or his name but this creator has really awesome uh, custom content. Alright, so our next one is also the Sharingan, and it's only, I think, I believe it's only three 
different selections and this is actually from the characters in the anime and each dot on the eye represent a certain power they have so like I said if you don't know the movie you have no idea what I'm talking about <laughs> I download a lot from them so yeah all right next one from the same creators as the previous one that I didn't know how to pronounce his or her name very beautiful uh, color selection looks very natural on a smaller eye of course but I'm just showing you on a much bigger eye so you can see very clearly very very alluring absolutely love it <laughs> and then our next one is from SM easiest name to pronounce um, this one I think the purpose of this is to make a very doll like eyes but if the sim moves the eyes too much to the right or too much to the left there is a lot of black in it so it does look sort of creamy but like I said, it's a very doll-like eyes and it does come in a variety of um, not really bright colors, kind of dark colors. Alright, next one is by Hess, H-E-S-S, eyes A. And once again, another doll-like eye feel to it and it comes in a crap load of colors, a lot of bright colors. And I do absolutely love this. I do want to find a way to kind of add these uh, color contacts into my LPs, but I don't really have a chance to so I gotta figure out something later on down the line <laughs> All right, so next one is um, by S Club one of my Another all-time favorite creators and this one has I don't know kind of a cartoony um, But yet somewhat of a realistic look to it and does come in a variety of color as well um, really makes a learning no, it really makes the eyes pop and a very alluring. What the hell am I saying? <laughs> Alright, and that's that one. And then next one is the N3 Dot Tifa. And this one, it does really have a realistic look to the eyes, but not so much when you have really bright, vibrant colors. I think if they have uh, much darker colors, it will look very, very vibrant. Yeah, so it's a really overall, really nice color contact. And then the next one, again from Naruto, this one, I don't know if all the eyes are actually representing each character in the movie, there are some, but like I said, if you did not watch it, you have no idea, so you can go ahead and skip through this if you want, but it is fun color contacts to play with. Alright, and then the next one is also by SM, another doll-like eyes, I absolutely love these kind of eyes, I know it's a little creepy, but it just kind of gives the sim more of a doll-like feature, you know, if you're trying to go for that theme. And it does come in a variety of colors. Alright, so our next one, this one I think is really cool because it has the star kind of, I don't know, like star glare, I think they're meant to be glare, but it has a star icon on the eyes, it's like three different sizes, and it comes in a different variety of bright colors, so that's really, really fun to play with. And last but not least, another Naruto eye contact. So this one I know is absolutely creepy. I think I added this into my thumbnail and my intro, but it was... Oh my god, if you guys watch the show, you'll know what I'm talking about. This is like a really cool eye that they added in to one of the characters from the anime, and I was just like, oh crap, they have it. <laughs> but yeah, like I said, if you never watched it, you will have no idea what I'm talking about. But that pretty much sums up all the girls' eyes. I don't think the guys have any eyes. Like, specifically for guys. They're basically unisex. Yeah, so a lot of the cat eyes are unisex. And every one of the eyes for the female is available for male as well. So, yeah, I totally used this eye on Yang when I created my intro and my thumbnail. I think it just makes it look so scary and alluring. It totally matches my background. Uh, but yeah, so that pretty much wraps up all the showcase I have for today's video showing you all the eye color contacts And yeah, hope you guys did enjoy this and let me know what you think of this video Like do you like me doing all these CC showcase like yay or nay? Um, just let me know your opinion and let me know which custom content is your favorite because honestly, they're all my favorites especially with the Naruto color contacts. Let me know what you think of the Naruto color contacts. Like, for some of you, it may be the first time seeing it. Let me know what you guys think. Do you think it's like a really cool creation? I thought it was freaking genius for those producers to create these stories and the color contacts and you know, just the way of their style. 
But yeah, uh, like always, thank you for watching. Hope you guys have a wonderful day. Don't forget to comment, rate, or subscribe if you haven't already because you're not going to regret it. <laughs> and I will see you in my next one. Bye, everyone.